So Francesca, what makes a successful settling in? Many things make a successful settling in. One of the key aspects of it is to show confidence and confidently welcome the family and the child into the GAN with enthusiasm, with a smile, to make them feel like they're in the right place at the right time and to support the child in feeling confidence in their own first steps into the GAN. And what, what role do all the staff play, not just the person that's responsible for settling? What's your experience of how other staff can support this settling? First and foremost, I think to make the parents feel welcome, to introduce themselves to the parents, perhaps say a little bit about their role within the GAN, introduce themselves to the child, and again, really try and make the family feel like they're, they're in the right place and that we as a team are together as one in welcoming them and supporting them. And what kind of barriers have you seen to successful settling? Where things have maybe not gone to plan, but could have been done differently and would have worked out better? Okay, I think first and foremost, uh, the, the first difficulty that can happen is when a member of staff opens the gate. Now, when a member of staff opens the gate, they may not know that this is the family who are settling. So the member of staff should always welcome any family who appear at the gate with warm and welcoming and open arms. I think another difficulty is, is when the staff might feel a little bit afraid of the parents or afraid of giving them a clear instruction because our, our, our task is to settle the child and within that task is being clear with the parents. And often staff don't feel... And what about barriers, thinking about the parents, what about barriers that you've experienced from the kind of parents' side as well? For the parents, I think the, the key barrier is their nervousness. And they're, they're often very nervous and afraid of giving their child over either to a new GAN or to the first GAN that the child's ever been in. Um, and the parents can be very... Uh, hold on to their child, not let their child go. Or you can get the opposite side of that, which is when the parent really doesn't show any interest in the child's settling process. They can sit on their phone, they have a chat to whoever you know is around them. And it's just about trying to find the happy balance between them being with the child but stepping back. So what advice would you give staff in terms of supporting parents with, with their anxiety or appropriate behaviour? I think the staff need to remember first and foremost that they're the ones in charge. It's their space and the parent has come into their space. And it's okay to give them clear instruction. If the parent's sitting there on their phone, they can say to the parent, listen, it's not appropriate for this space, uh, please put your phone away, uh, or you could step outside to go on your phone. And sometimes the nervousness or anxiety manifests itself with parents in different ways. For example, they may complain about things or they may be um, sometimes appear not very nice to the staff. They might feel that they're nitpicking at things because they do things differently at home. Um, in those situations, have you come across things like that? Oh, many, many times. Can you give us some examples? Yes, I can give you an example. So, for example, we had one child coming in. It was the first time that they'd ever been to GAN, and the parent was incredibly nervous. And it came across as actually quite aggressive. And the parent was giving quite short commands to the staff in their space about what the child did and didn't like doing, and telling the staff what they could and couldn't do with the child. So in that case, really, the staff needs to uh, hold on to their professionalism and really say to the parent, it's okay, don't worry, we're in control. Why don't we and you sit and talk together and really, in a way, settle the parent more than the child, if you can see that the child's, you know, ready to start exploring. You know, a settling in is also about the parent, and, and, but you must retain your professional attitude towards the parent and not let yourself get flustered or take it personally. It's not you, it's the situation. Thanks, Francesca. No problem.